Hello everybody. I went today to Harbor Freight and I got this uh, trailer dolly and um, it's going to help me move my dolly around. That's going to pull my car, my car over there. Uh, my dolly goes right here, but back here's my dolly. This is my dolly. This is the what my car is going on. And what I have found is when I need to move this this thing, you pick it up right here and you pull it around. Which it, it's 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 heavy. So this is actually a a, a unboxing where I'm going to open it up and see what we got. And uh, like I said, I got it from Harbor Freight. It's called a Hall Master. It's to move to move the dolly around to make it a lot easier on me and Tina. So that's what it looks like. You got uh, tires with uh, tubes in it. So you see the, where to put the air in it. So we got two of those. And basically, just have to put the rest of it together. Don't look like it's gonna be that hard. All right. Well, I'm gonna try to do this without reading the instructions. Let's see if it's going to be that easy. Okay, maybe I should look at the instructions. Okay, I looked at them. I looked at them. So, this one goes on here like this, evidently. Uh, yeah, you can't, can't go wrong with that. So, this goes on here. Looks like all the screws are the same size except one. And I don't know why that one's shorter, but I do know that if this. So basically what I'm doing is I'm tightening these up. There's this one bracket right here. So I'm gonna put these in here like this. Right like that. So, what I'm doing is I, I put these four bolts in here with this bracket or brace, and uh, that's going to make that whole handle stay together. This is the handle. So you had those four bolts right here, and it went right through there and it bolted on. Okay. Now the next one is, the next one is right here. This just bolts right on here. And it also takes two bolts. fly on me. Get off me fly. All right. Well now, since I've gotten this on and these on, I'm going to go ahead and slide these wheels on. And basically all you do is you just slide the wheel on, put this washer through here like this. And then put this carter key through here. 
them right like that. And then bend it. And bend it. So that tire won't come back off. There we go. All right, I'm gonna flip it over. And then we'll put this tire on there. Same thing, washer. And the Carter key, Carter key. Okay, there we go. Got it bent. Okay. So, you know what that means, right? Means those gotta come back off. Sometimes you gotta read the instructions. Uh -huh. <laughs> you don't do that often, do you? Nah. Uh, most men don't, I don't think. I don't think they do anyway. They waved whoever they was. I suppose this one right here goes up through here. So, before you put this bracket right here on these two and you tie if you tighten these down you still have to put this on so make sure you get this on when you tighten these bolts down so now i'm going to put this bolt in right here as you see i made that mistake had to take them back off and put them back on so I kind of messed up and I didn't put this on before I put these bolts through this one bracket right here I put on and I tightened it down on here and then so I had to take it back apart to put this on so now that's what I'm doing I'm putting this on right now almost done Got that tight now. Now, let's see what this thing is. What is this? Aha! Uh -huh. I've seen. And I did it again. I did it again. So, this right here goes right here. Huh. So, I forgot to put this on. See? You should always, always read the instructions. So now, let me take that back off. Dang it. other bracket on there yeah there's something about reading instructions what is that why why is that so let me get this thing back out Number two, or three, or four.
Now this is the last one of this of the bolts. So now I've got to put this bolt in right here. tighten this one up this is uh, not all the way tightened so mm -hmm. this one right here We got this part done right here and this is pretty much what the picture looks like just don't do the mistakes i've made before i put these uh screws in here these bolts in right here i bolted this right here to this and this not realizing that uh, this had to go on the back side so i had to take these back out put this on and then put the nuts and the washers on it then i turned around and did the same thing over here i put this bolt in right here not realizing that I had to put this bracket on here, so I had to take it back out, put the bracket on. So anyway, that's where I'm at. So now the only thing I got to do is put the ball on it. And then we'll take it over there and try it out. Now, this thing comes with a one and seven eighths uh, one and seven eighths inch ball. So my dolly has a two inch has a two inch ball on it or it's made for a two inch ball so this will still work i mean i'm just moving the moving the dolly not hauling it by it over the road so, so yeah this goes in here like this if you want to put a two inch a two inch uh, ball on here you can but if you're just moving something like what what I'm moving, yeah, you'll be all right. Okay. Well, there you have it. Now I'm going to take it back there and I'm going to hook it up to the the dolly and. So I'm going to show you how this thing works. This GoPro hasn't been nice to me today. I've already filmed this once. Went into edit, and guess what? It froze up on me. So anyway, this is how it works. You, I'll put, I'll uh, slip it over here. Set it up there, and uh, I'll be able to move it anywhere I want. So this right here is just like front front wheels to the dolly. So this is how it works.
got the grass back there holding me up, but, but yeah. As long, long as I'm on a flat surface, like uh, this concrete or black top, it'll work. It'll work real good. But uh, yeah, this is how, how, it's, how it's all done. But yeah, you just got to make sure when you go to put this thing together, before you put this on here, and you tighten these bolts down make sure you have this thing right here on because those nuts and washer will go on the other side so yeah same thing with this before you bolt this and this put that bolt through you got to make sure you have this on here because that same bolt holds this on and this on then of course you know you got the one bolt right here pretty much everything else you You'd have to really mess up to mess up, <laughs> if you know what I mean. But anyway, yeah, so that's how it works. Um, yeah, it was like $69 at Harbor Freight, and it's going to help us out a lot. Like I said earlier, when I bought that, that dolly, the car dolly, we pulled it pulled up and I unhooked it right here. And we tried to, me and Tina tried to take it up the driveway. And it was almost impossible. We couldn't do it by ourselves. So what I did, I went over and got my side by side out of the garage and just hooked the dolly up to it and brought it up in here. And that's when I figured out that I needed one of these really bad. So uh, we went and got it and I put it together and it looks like it's gonna work great. We're just gonna have to carry it with us in the RV or in the trunk of the car, one of the two. So but anyway, that's our uh, our unboxing or our kind of preview, I guess, of this, this item from Harbor Freight. And uh, I hope you like it and uh, if you like this kind of video just let us know in the comments but anyway like subscribe and hit that bell and thank you for watching okay bye bye <laughs>